Hello friends, welcome back to Technique. Today we'll be doing the performance testing of the new OnePlus Nord CE4. So we have the OnePlus Nord CE4 with us. So let's just go to the settings and uh, take the about device. So you can see here Oxygeno is 14 and we have the OnePlus Nord CE4. Snapdragon 7 Gen 3 mobile platform, 5500 mAh battery and Android version is 14. Now this device comes with uh, the Oxygen OS also 14 version. That's the latest version. So we have updated the device to the latest version. OnePlus Nord CE4 with the Snapdragon 7 Gen 3 and uh, 8 GB RAM and 256 GB storage. So that's the device. So we're going to do the, uh, the performance testing of this device. So we'll do the CPU throttling test, the wildlife uh, X extreme or stress test then we'll go to the anti-2 benchmark then we'll see the storage test and finally let's see the geekbench 6 test so let's start with uh, the cpu throttling test so before that if this is your first time on this channel do hit that red subscribe button and also hit the bell icon to get notified of all the videos we publish so let's begin so this is the cpu throttling app so we have set uh, the 20 thread and 15 minute test so let's start the test So now we have completed uh, the throttling test and you can see here beyond the 12 minute mark uh, it has started to throttle and you can see a CPU throttle to 72% of its max performance and uh, you can see that uh, the max value 298 gibs and uh, you can see here the minimum is 211 it's not a very bad performer actually it's 72% uh, of the uh, device uh, was the, I mean CPU was throttle and uh, you can also see that the battery drain from uh, 97 percentage it uh, went up to 91 percentage so around uh, uh, 6 percentage drop in the 15 minute test and we'll also check the temperature so 39 degrees so in the throttling test uh, there wasn't uh, much of heat generated you can see here that's the temperature so that is the throttling test and uh, next let's go to the stress test. So next uh, let's go with uh, the stress testing. So 3D Mark Wildlife uh, Extreme uh, Stress Test. So now we have completed uh, the wildlife extreme uh, stress test. You can see here best loop score is 1487 and lowest loop score is 1480. So stability is 99.5. So that's a pretty good value actually. So 99.5 percentage. Now you can see the all the loop score and let's also check the battery. So almost uh, uh, 6 percentage drop uh, from 90 percentage to 84 percentage in terms of uh, the test. So temperature was uh, from 31 to 37 degrees. So again, uh, the cooling is uh, handled pretty well. The thermals are quite good actually. Now the frame is 7 uh, FPS to 13 FPS. So temperature is quite good actually. 37 degrees was the maximum during this test, which is in bad actually. And the overall uh, score for the wildlife extreme stress test is 99.5, which is quite good now next uh, and uh, uh, the next uh, test is the benchmark test so we have the anti-2 benchmark score so we have tested this and uh, you can uh, see the score here so uh, the score is 8 lakh 13 thousand uh, uh, 399 and the cpu score the gp score the memory score and the ux score you can see here it's quite a good uh, cheap uh, for this price segment uh, more than 8 lakh is the anti -do benchmark score so you can also see during the anti -do benchmark score around three percentage battery drain happen and from 35 to 39 degrees it went around four percentage four degree increase or rather 3.8 degree increase during testing and 3 percentage battery drop during that test. Now let's uh, see the storage test. So you can see a 75,582 it is UFS 3.1 which is quite good uh, once again for this price segment. So this is the uh, storage test. Now finally let's uh, see the uh, Geekbench test. So now we have the Geekbench score here. You can see here single core score is 1136 and multi core score for the OnePlus Nord uh, C4 is 3074 which is quite good I would say for uh, a mid-range device. So you can see here uh, the result of uh, the single core and the multi-core uh, values. 
so you can uh, see that um, the relative values are also mentioned here so you can see this is a quite good score so that was uh, the performance testing of the oneplus nord c4 hope you enjoyed watching this video do hit that red subscribe button and also hit the bell icon to get notified of all the videos we publish so thanks for watching hope to see you in our next video have a great day